morning children welcome back ivs online class see in previous class we finished clothes we wear okay that lesson lesson number 4 clothes we wear so we recall it once okay children so why we why why do we need clothes tell me why uh, we are wearing clothes so we need clothes to cover our body and it gives protection okay we need clothes to cover uh, cover our body and it give protection to our body body okay so and also it protects from rain wind heat cold dust and insects bite it also protects from rain wind heat cold dust and insects bites okay so we should always we should always wear neat and clean clothes okay to um, protect from diseases okay so to protect from diseases we should wear always neat and clean clothes and also and also we are looking very nice and smart in beautiful clothes isn't children so for your birthday you are wearing new dress on that time on that day you are looking very nice isn't no so uh, we are wearing the clothes so some clothes we are wearing that it gives look good looking okay and we are looking beautiful also so do you wear or do you wear uh, same clothes throughout the year no we are not wearing same clothes throughout the year according to the season according to occasions we are wearing different clothes okay so mainly we are uh, we have three seasons that is summer season winter season and rainy season so we will see which clothes we are wearing according to the seasons so first of all, first of all so we will see clothes we are wearing in summer season which clothes we are wearing in summer season okay so in summer summer means what it's very hot the sun shines so brightly isn't no we can't see the sun with our bare eyes so the um, the, the weather is very hot so on that summer season we are wearing cotton clothes so we are wearing cotton clothes because why because it gives it is a light weight and it keeps our body cool summer clothes so sorry we are wearing summer uh, season cotton clothes uh, that means the cotton clothes keep our body cool and uh, it it is a light weight okay the cotton clothes are light weight and it absorbs sweat it absorbs sweat so and it keeps cool our body okay so uh, these cotton where we get this cotton we get cotton from cotton plants so where we get this cotton we get cotton from cotton plants from cotton we are um, from cotton we are uh, making see t-shirts skirts bunions uh, some other frocks so some other dresses we are Uh, wearing in summer seasons these are all dress made of cotton okay so why we are wearing cotton clothes in summer because cottons are lightweight and it absorbs sweating so and it keeps cool our body it keeps cool our body okay now come to the winter season which clothes we are wearing in winter season in winter it is very cold the weather is very cold isn't it yes we are prefer to drink hot milk hot uh, hot drinks isn't it children coffee tea so hot coffee hot tea we are prefer to drink in winter season and rainy season also so because the weather is very cool and we are wearing we prefer to wear in winter season that is woolen cloth we are wearing woolen cloth in winter season these woolen where we get these woolen we get from sheep 
that wool from the wool we are making woolen sweaters woolen socks woolen uh, scrops okay then woolen caps woolen jackets see these are all uh, we are uh, that these are all made of wool okay where we get this wool we get wool from sheep okay so these are all these these are all dresses keeps our body warm okay that's why we are wearing woolen cloth in winter season now come to the rainy season rainy means always rain will comes isn't it children yes on that uh, seasons on that days we are using umbrellas and we are uh, wearing that um, rain coat rain coat um, then um, rain jacket rainy jackets so in this seasons we are wearing rainy jacket rain coat and we are using umbrella also these are all made of leather where we get this leather we get uh, leather from skin of dead animals we get leather from skin of dead animals so from this leather they are uh, we are making rain coat rain jackets isn't children okay and we are also using umbrellas so occasionally except this occasionally we are wearing silk cloth occasionally we are wearing silk cloth that means when you are going to some party function or temple or in your home you are doing puja or some festival on that time we are not we are uh, not wearing ordinary dresses we are wearing special dresses so that means we are wearing silk silk cloth so uh, that silk where we get this silk the, the we get silk from silk worm we get silk from silk worm so we are not we are not wearing you regularly the silk cloth so occasionally we are wearing silk cloth this silk cloth we get from silk worm so now we'll see according to their occupation people the way they are wearing different clothes so we will see so we we wear special clothes when they do special jobs when we do special jobs we are wearing special clothes these clothes is known as uniform these clothes are called as uniform what is mean by uniform what is that in previous class i teach you now yes so people wear special clothes when they are doing special jobs these clothes we called as uniform okay okay people they are wearing special cloth when they are doing special jobs these clothes we called as uniform that means see the policeman uh, is wearing uh, that is the uh, some special dress okay so and lawyer doctor so these are all postman these are all wearing their own dresses so uh, so these dresses identify what they are doing which job they are doing okay children so these dresses can identify the what they are doing so people wear uniform according to their job people wear uniform according to their job these uniform help us to what they are doing which job they are doing so children you are all wearing you are all wearing uniform to school isn't it no 
so at home you are wearing normal dresses but when you are coming to the school you are wearing uniform and when you are going some when you are attend some function some party uh, then you are wearing different dresses isn't it children so like that according to their uniform we can identify what they are doing see policeman so wear police uniform so lawyer they are wearing black coat if they are wearing black coat we can identify he is a lawyer then uh, some people wearing white coat and white frocks that we can identify that is doctors is it not children doctors and nurses they are wearing white coat and lawyer they are wearing black coat then children are wearing uniforms so and policeman they are wearing police uniform like that postman drivers watchman they are all wearing they own uniforms so uniform help us to the identify the people what they are doing which job they are doing and some uh, special dresses also on special occasions we are wearing that means when you are going to party or when you are doing puja at home you are wearing special dresses and you are need dresses is it not children so uh, these special dresses also we are wearing when we are going uh, some occasion some party so and um, so all these dress all these clothes we are wearing we are using regularly in our day to day life so these we should take care of our clothes so we should always wear clean washed and iron cloth we are always wear clean washed and iron cloth see unwashed cloth can be uh, cause skin diseases we can't wear unwashed cloth okay it may it may be uh, skin diseases so we should we should wear always washed clean and iron cloth we should take care of our cloth okay children so about this lesson the points which points you can remember so we need first point we need um, clothes to cover and protect our body and we are wear different kinds of clothes on different season the three season summer season winter season and rainy season in summer season we are wearing cotton cloth this cotton made of cotton uh, this cotton cotton where we get this cotton we get from cotton plants okay so in winter season we are wearing woolen dresses these wool where we get we get wool from sheep and in rainy season we are wearing rain coat rain jackets and we are using umbrella also these are all get from leather these leather where we get the skin of dead animals we get this leather from skin of dead animals and occasionally we are also using some silk cloth these silk where we get the silk we get from silk worm so and we also according to their some people they will do a oh, special job they are wearing special cloth according to their job we can according to their uh, cloth we can identify which job they are doing that is we call uniform some people wear special cloth when they are doing special job these cloths we called as uniform so uniform identify the people what they are which job they are doing so we should take care of this cloth we should always wear neat and clean washed cloth okay so we should take care of this cloth now we understand children yes now uh, the, i will give assignment for you take down your homework book and write it okay assignment that is homework you should write two two times okay so first main 
name two clothes used in the following season that is one side i am giving seasons so according to the season which cloth you are wearing which cloth you are using you have to write two to example okay summer in summer which cloth you are wearing give only two examples okay then rainy season Okay, wait. I will write here season also. Otherwise, you will confused. Summer season. So you should write two cloth. Which cloth you are wearing? In rainy season, two cloth. Then winter. winter season which cloth you are using tell me now see name two clothes used in the following season first what they give summer season so summer season which cloth we are wearing that is cotton cloth yes tell me two example so cotton shirt cotton shirt and cotton frock okay so while writing you should say loudly spellings c o t t o n cotton s h i r t shirt c o t t o n cotton f r o c k frock like that you have to uh, write you have to tell and write loudly okay then uh, come to the rainy season so in rainy season which cloth we are using yes rain coat so rain coat and rain jacket okay in rainy season we are using rain coat and rain jacket come to the winter season winter season which cloth we are wearing woolen so woolen cap or woolen sweater okay so in winter season we are wearing woolen cap woolen sweater then come to the second main second main that is match the following Okay. So here given one side summer, winter, and rain. So other side sweater, umbrella.
and t-shirt. So you should match or otherwise you should put the number. In summer season we are wearing t-shirt. Okay. In winter season we are wearing yes, sweater. And in rainy season we are using umbrella. Okay. See, in summer season we are wearing t-shirt and winter season we are wearing full and sweaters and in rainy season we are using umbrella okay children yes then come to the third main so third main Arrange the things according to the season. Arrange the things. See here. According to the season. Okay. Some things I am giving here. According to their, according to the season, summer season, winter season and rainy season, according to the season you have to write which things we are using in which season. So, first of all, I will write all the things, umbrella, raincoat, cap, Pull and gloves. Okay. Sweater. Gumboots. Then cotton shirt. Cotton frock. Then last one, woolen jacket, woolen socks, okay, these are all, so these are all the things I grambled here, okay, so you have to you have to separate it according to the season so how many seasons we have three seasons isn't children so i'm writing answer here summer winter and rainy okay So, according to the season, which cloth we are wearing, you have to write. Okay, tell me, umbrella, when we are using umbrella? Yes, when rain comes. So, you have to write here under rainy season, we are using umbrella. Okay, then. Come to the raincoat. When we are using raincoat, yes, tell me. So, raincoat also we are using in rainy season. Isn't children? When rain comes, you are wearing raincoat. So, raincoat. Cap. When we are using cap, yes, tell me. When we are using cap, when? Summer. Summer season, we are using cap. Woolen gloves. So, we are using woolen in winter season. So, woolen gloves. So, then come to the sweater. When we are using sweater, 
in winter season only so we should write under winter season then gumboots when we are using gumboots yes in rainy season okay in rainy season we are wearing then come to the cotton shirt cotton shirt so is in summer season okay then cotton frock as usual summer season then last one woolen socks so that is winter season are you understood now yes according to the season you have to separate the cloth which season we are wearing so these are all three main homeworks and when you are writing homeworks you should say loudly and write and after finishing two times in the homework book so make it habit to write in the rough note and you learn okay until you get so you have to write three, three times five, five times how much how many times you want you can write you learn spellings in rough note okay children so uh, next the this lesson number 4 cloths we wear the exercise part is there we will do in the next class okay thank you children